All right, guys, welcome back to Heyman's Bad Week Part 2. If you missed Part 1, go back and watch the link in the description. Paul Heyman, I asked Vince for a match against you on Sunday, and he agreed. So I guess I'll see you in the ring Sunday. So Brock Lesnar is going to get a face Paul Heyman in the ring. Let's see what happens. I'm here with Paul Heyman and Ryback. Wait, Paul's going to get somebody to fight on his behalf? I thought he was fighting him. So glad to be here, Cole. Yeah, he would tell him to shut up. This isn't realistic. This is my new client and best friend for life, Ryback. He'll be fighting Brock for me. Really? Me, Ryback. Feed me more. Feed me more. <laughs> so Ryback is just like, feed me. Oh, shut up, says Paul. There it is. They're going out to fight. SummerSlam. Let's do it right now. Back to you guys. That was very awkward. Feed me more. Feed me more. The match of the summer is coming up next. As I I think he was just about ready to walk into a locker. Oh, God. Nobody's had that much of a train wreck since they watched the main event and I on television. So here we are. We're at SummerSlam. I actually got to see Brock Lesnar wrestle at SummerSlam, and he is the world heavyweight champion. He told Brock Lesnar, Brock Lesnar, excuse me, told Paul Heyman to shove it. He doesn't need him speaking for him anymore. And now he's going to fight him, except Paul Heyman weaseled out of it like the weasel he is. Oh, his pyro didn't work, just like in real life. As Paul Heyman will fight him through the means of Ryback. So, wow, what a main event we have. The U.S. champion versus the world heavyweight champion. What if this is just a storyline? They just want to beat the fuck out of Ryback. He just wants both the titles. Feed me, Lesnar. This is a little joke. You know it's not going to happen. Oh, man, he looks pissed, though. So here we go. World Heavyweight Championship. This is going to be Ryback versus Brock Lesnar in WWE 2. K-14 custom story. Let's get into it. So here we go. If I'm Brock Lesnar, I'm pissed, and I just want to beat the shit out of Ryback. Come here, you walrus. Going right after Paul Heyman. Paul Heyman scoured his way out of this match. Through the use of Ryback, now Brock is pissed. Brock's going after both of them. As it's turning into a two-on-one, that's what she said. Clothesline, down goes Ryback. Clothesline, down goes Paul Heyman. Tries to go for him again, now belly to belly from Ryback. Trying to use the lessons he taught him. As Brock Lesnar can be counted out here trying to go after Paul Heyman. Just get back in the ring. You don't want to lose to Ryback. As here we go. Back in the ring now. Going right after the midsection. There we go. That's smart. Every time you try to pin him now, Paul's going to stop him. So we need to get Paul ejected. We need to get Paul ejected from this match ASAP. Because I love me managers when they save me, but when they're taking me out. What a power bomb! Down goes Ryback. Go for the pin. Rope break. That's not what we wanted. And Ryback finally catches him. And down we go to the mat as Ryback. Prah, prah, just beating the shit out of us. Hi, Mom. Hey, Mom. He says something to him. He's like, Ryback, you're supposed to do something. He's like, fine, fuck you. He's playing hard. That's what she said. Wait, Ryback, no selling it right now. There is another one. You over the top, Germany. But Paul Heyman's running his mouth. He almost took his head off with that Paul Heyman running his mouth. But look, now Ryback's able to capitalize. So Paul Heyman played a little bit of goat there. He got him to come outside of the ring. And now Ryback beating the hell out of Paul Heyman. Or, uh, excuse me, his former client, Brock Lesnar. As Ryback has capitalized... But Ryback took too much time to gloat. Now Brock Lesnar capitalizes, looking for a uh, suplex middle of the ring. Because I don't know how smart this is. 
Paul Heyman provoked the beast. I want a two-on-one match. Actually, I want, I want to get my hands on Paul Heyman. Beating Ryback doesn't have the same satisfaction. As he's just mounting him. Shot, shot, shot. It's like I'm in the club taking shots right now with the amount of beatings that he's taken. And down he goes. All right, looking for that triple power bomb. One. Look at the strength of Brock Lesnar. Two. Look at the strength of Ryback. Three. Down he goes, middle of the ring. One. Two. Wait a minute. Paul Heyman. Getting involved. Ryback capitalizes. But no, he's not able to do anything with it. So Paul Heyman is going to provide that distraction. We knew this would happen. So he's got to clear him out. He's got to basically end him. He's on the outside. He fights out. Look at this. He's going to be too much. How is Brock Lesnar going to overcome? Finally. Paul Heyman has been ejected. The referee now makes this straight up. So Paul Heyman is gone. Paul Heyman will not be involved in the decision. So this is finally going to be a clean fight. As Ryback sending Brock Lesnar back in the ring. I don't know how smart that was. Caught him with a Kimura. He caught him with a Kimura lock. And no, he's not. he doesn't have enough to uh, end Ryback there. I think he was trying to look for the F5 and he hit the wrong button. Seems like the guy controlling Brock Lesnar might be an idiot. Wait. I'm the guy controlling Brock Lesnar. Hashtag Illumin idiot confirmed. Is Brock Lesnar just going after that head? You know what? We're going to end him. If I have to taunt spam a little bit. Uh-oh. You want to hit your comeback there, bud? Finally. Going for a comeback. Brock Lesnar says, I don't think so. Clothesline, down he goes. Just when you thought Ryback had a shot. Fall away slam. And that'll do it. You thought he could come back, but in the end, Brock Lesnar. He's got him up top for the F5. F5 middle of the ring, and that'll do it. So Brock Lesnar has beat Paul Heyman's guy. One, two, three. Middle of the ring at SummerSlam. World Heavyweight Champion is victorious. Thanks for coming, Paul Heyman. That's what you get. Wait a minute. Double Cena's. What the fuck? Wait, what? What are Double Cena's doing out here? You got the WWE Champion... And the World Heavyweight Champion beating up the World Heavyweight Champion. It's a three-man. So Paul Heyman's got a new stable. What the hell? So yeah, there it is. In the end, it was just a beatdown. It was a setup. There are nothing left to do. So Paul Heyman's bad week ends like that. Until next time, guys, get your boy Toby email, and we will see you all later.